Hello, this is Kathy from The Daily Marker, and I'm so excited to be participating in this blog hop today. I created some invitations with this awesome die cut from Simon Says Stamps' newest release. I thought, why not have an ice cream party? I wanted to share with you how I created this set of invitations using the Ice Cream Cone Parade die cut and the on the road die cut. I love how you can fit a sentiment in the bottom part of this. I went ahead and printed the sentiments off on my computer. All of these dashes in this die cut are perfect for ribbon. So I'm just clipping the ends of my ribbon and I'm gonna feed it through the little dashes. Before I do that, I love using this foam on everything. And what I like to do is I cut it in half, that way I get twice as much mileage from it. So I'm going to place that in the center of the ribbon. And I'm going to I'm going to center that on the face of this die cut. This die cut is great to use as a card the center of a card. So feed that through the little road part. You could also use embroidery floss and just have some fun with it. And I like to tape it down on the back, just on the edges, just to make sure that it's flat and it keeps its shape. Once I die cut my ice cream cones, I'm careful when I lift it out of, off of the cutting mat and I put some tape down on the entire back and then I poke it through here. There's a lot of great tools on the market to poke through your die cuts, but I use a paper piercer most often. So lift that off carefully, and I've already pre-cut my card bases to fit like a four by six. This die is perfect for that. I want to glue that down. I want to have it centered on my card. So I'm using some of this post-it tape, and I'm going to tape it down before I glue it just to make sure that it's centered. This will help me center it, and then when I pop up the front, I won't have to spend a lot of time doing that. So I always like to use glossy accents as my glue, so I'm doing that. And then I'm going to flip it over and put it on my card base. Just give a little press and remove that tape, and then I'm it's centered when I pop the front of on the road die, I'll be ready to go. So go ahead and pick up your die cut again and pop out the outline of ice cream cone parade, and then just press it down. Remember that you taped the back of this ice cream code parade so when you stick this down it'll stay there so that's always a good thing of course when you're prepping invitations once you have your design down it's good to have all the parts ready to go and then you can just assemble it now I want to show you how I have the parts of the ice cream cone how I did that. I cut a strip of cardstock and I'm putting it through a Xyron. And I'm going to, you just have to press down, peel that off, and then you can die cut. This way I don't have to add glue or it's just faster, especially when you're doing a set of cards. I'm going to speed that up. It's really quick and easy and then I'm going to show you how I did the ice cream cone part. Now what I did was I die cut felt that I had on hand, I got it at a craft store or something and I used glossy, no sorry, not glossy accents, distressed stickles on the felt. It took a while for it to dry, I wasn't in a hurry, I had other things to assemble for the card and it gives the ice cream just a luscious, realistic look. Can you see that glitter? So I'm going ahead 
and assembly mine all my pieces now and to pop the face of the card which is the on the road die I'm cutting this foam tape into teeny tiny skinny strips and you know this is another way how I get that mileage but the invitations got a lot more depth when I went through this extra step it just made everything stand out more then you just peel the backing off of the foam tips make sure it's in all the corners and center that on your card since we glued it down first it made the centering of that card front really super duper to do if you're making a single card it's fun to take that an extra step and add seed pearls or seed beads to the ice cream thank you for watching and have fun hopping